what the? Hello, everybody, it is Cybersonic, and welcome back to Undertale. In the last episode, I have almost completed the genocide. I reset it at the last moment. And oh boy, after that nearly complete genocide, uh, the aborted genocide run, I started doing a true pacifist, and uh, at a few points, it was referenced that I did a genocide, even though I didn't actually complete it. Uh, at Toriel, there's that part where, I, where it said, You felt like you wanted to tell Toriel that you saw her die, but that would be creepy. There's also other parts in the game where it's like, that like that talk about you actually wanting to uh, kill everybody. Uh, I think it was like, at Flowey, it said something around the lines of, um, Kara, why, why did you just fail? Why did you just fail the genocide route? Why did you just quit? And the game was like pretty much referencing how I killed everybody. I think even Papyrus and other characters faintly remember that. But luckily I didn't complete it, because if you complete the genocide route, you'd get a soulless pacifist ending, and we're getting a true pacifist. I did not complete it, otherwise known as giving my soul up to Kara. So I did not give my soul up to him. I uh I let Frisk uh me as Frisk, I reset the genocide, but let's let's continue. This is the barrier. <laughs> This is what keeps us all trapped underground. If, if by chance you have any unfinished business, please do what you must. Continue. I see. This is it then. Ready? Holy shit! My strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. It seems your journey is finally over. I'm not doing that determination reading. The fans are so they're so cancerous with that. It's like you're filled with determination. I'm tired of seeing comments saying you're filled with determination. That that's that's cringe. That's cringe. God, Undertale fandom is cringe. Very comparable to the Fortnite. Oh, maybe I should do one episode of Fortnite. I've played it before, but it's like a really shit game, though. <laughs> Human, it was nice to meet you. Goodbye. Oh, you made that yourself, Azzy? Oh, that must be Toriel. Yeah, I knew it the entire time. What a miserable creature, torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Do not be afraid, my child. It is I, Toriel, your friend and guardian. At first, I thought I would let you make your journey alone. But I could not stop worrying about you. Your adventure must be so treacherous. And ultimately, it would burden you with horrible choice. To leave this place, you'll have to take the life of another person. You'll have to defeat Asgore. However, I realize I cannot allow that. It is not right to sacrifice someone simply to let someone leave here. Is that not what I've been trying to prevent this whole time? So for now, let us suspend this battle. As terrible as Asgore is, he deserves mercy too. He's my favorite character in the game, actually. Tori, you came back. What the fuck was that? Tori, you came back. Do not Tori me, dreamer. You pathetic whelp. You really wanted to free our kind. You could have gone through the barrier after you got one soul, taking six souls from humans to come back here. Toriel, you're so fucking stupid. That would cause another monster war with the humans. You stupid bitch, I hate you. I actually like you, but that's really stupid. Asgore, don't don't talk to her. Don't 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 go don't, don't get sad about that. You're right. You should have waited here for seven. Because that's the most peaceful way. If you just go up there and say, fuck it, I'll kill some other people. That would have started another fucking war. But instead, you made everyone live in despair because you would rather wait here meekly hoping another human comes. Right, I'm a miserable creature, but do you what do you think we can at least be friends? <sighs> no, Asgore. Yeah! Asgore, human! Nobody fight each other! Everyone's gonna make friends or else I'll I'll Hello, I am Toriel. Are you the human's friend? It is nice to meet you. Uh yeah, nice to meet you. Hey Asgore, is that your ex? Jeez, that's rough, buddy. Hey! Nobody hurt each other! Oh, are you another friend? I'm Toriel, hello. Uh, <laughs> hi! There's two of them? Hey! Anybody 
everybody, nobody fight anyone. If anyone fights anyone, then I'll be forced. Oh, look at Undyne and, uh, Alphys locking eyes. Then I'll be forced to ask Undyne for help. Hello! Oh, hello, or I should say, Halo. I always say Halo instead of hello, I don't know why. Oh, hello, your majesty. Psst. Hey, human. This sh did Asgore Shafe? Oh my god, dude. Papyrus, oh my god, one thing I don't like about Papyrus is that he's stupid. I wish he was actually a little bit smarter. God, this, is why, this is one thing I don't like about Papyrus, he's so stupid. There you go, it's Sans. Hey guys, what's up? That voice. Oh, look at Asgore, look at his eyes. Hello, I think we may know each other. Oh, hey, I recognize your voice too. Hi, Antoria. Oh, look, Asgore's crying! <laughs> so nice to meet you. The name's Sans, and I'm same. Oh, wait, then. This must be your brother, Papyrus. Greetings, Papyrus. It's so nice to finally meet you. Your brother has told me so much about you. Wowie! I can't believe Asgore Clone knows who I am! This is the best day of my life! Hey, Papyrus, what does the skeleton tell his rule with? Snow? Shingles! Oh my God! Look at look at Papyrus's face! I changed my mind. It's the worst day of my life. Come on, Asgore. It's gonna be okay. There are plenty of fish in the sea. Yeah, Asgore. Unnice totally right about the fishing. Sometimes you've got to uh stop going after furry boss monsters and uh just get to know a really cute fish. It's a metaphor. No, it's not. Well, I think it's a good analogy. Oh my god. <sighs> no, we don't have time for the romance. We have time to, uh... Oh god, no, please don't. Not in front of the kids! But wait, not in front of the human. Thank you, Torio. Uh, right. Sorry, I got a little carried away there. <laughs> oh, there we go. Sans teleporting. <laughs> my child, it seems as if you must stay here for a while. But looking at all the great friends you have made, I think, I think you will be happy here. Hey, that reminds me. Papyrus, you called everyone here, right? Well, besides, uh, her. Uh, anyway, if I, if I got here before you, how did you know to, how to call her buddy? Let's just say, a tiny flower helped me. A tiny flower? Oh, that's gonna hurt. You idiots! While you guys are having a little powwow, I took the human soul! And not And now not only are those under my power, but all your friend souls are gonna be mine too! Oh god. Hehehe! <laughs> and you know what the best part is? It's all your fault! It's all because you made them love you, and all the time you spent listening to them, encouraging them, caring about them. Without that, they wouldn't have come here. And now, with their souls and the humans together, I will achieve my real form. Hehe. <laughs> huh? Why am I still doing this? Don't you get it? This is all just a game. If you leave the underground satisfied, you'll win the game. If you win, you won't want to play with me anymore. And what would I do then? But but this game between us will never end! I'll hold victory in front of you, just within your reach, and then tear it away before you grasp it! Over and over and over! <laughs> Listen, if you do defeat me, I'll give you your happy ending! I'll bring your friends back! I'll destroy the barrier! Everyone will finally be satisfied! But that won't happen! You! I'll keep you here no matter what! Even if it means killing you one million times! No, please no. Toriel, please save me. Thank you. What? Do not be afraid, my child. No matter what happens, we will always be there to protect you. 
That's right, human, you can win. Just do what I would do. Believe in you! Hey, human, if you got past me, you can do anything, especially if you're doing a genocide. Undying... The Undying is easily the hardest boss in this game, bruh. Sans... Sans isn't holding candle to Undying. Sans is really memorable. Everybody knows his attacks, basically, so he's easy to, to avoid and easy to predict. Alright, so don't worry, we're all the way here with you. Huh? You haven't beaten this guy yet? Come on, this hero's got nothing on you. Yeah, Sans, you're tough, but... Undying is the toughest, but yeah, Sans would totally kick Flowey's ass, even in the Omega Flowey form. Technically, it's impossible for you to beat him, but somehow, I know you can do it. Human, for the future of monsters and humans. You have to stay determined. We're here with you, too. La la, come on, you got this, you got the win, you can do it, rip it! Urgh. No! Unbelievable! This can't be happening! You! You! I can't believe you're all so stupid! All of your souls are mine! I wonder who this goat could be. Alright, turn around. Time for that face reveal, dude. It only took me six months to do my face reveal. Even though my face has actually been revealed on my channel before, on accident. <laughs> it was in one of my Instagram meme compilation, like, reactions, I think. <laughs> Finally, I was so tired of being a flower. There he is, Asriel. Howdy! Kara, are you there? It's me, your best friend. Asriel Dreamer. With two R's. It just makes sense, I guess. It's the end. Oh, wait. God dang it. I was supposed to do something else than that. What happens if he died at the beginning now? Oh, you cannot die at the beginning, it seems. Okay. I love this song. This is my favorite boss song in the game. Better than Megalovania. Alright, All right, here we go. Real final battle beat. No hits, no hits, no hits, no hits. No hits! No hits. Oh god! Oh yes! It refused! Well, that was horrible. Oh, I like this violin. I love this violin. Dude. You know, I don't care about destroying this world anymore. Uh-oh, 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 uh oh, oh, that was close. Chaos Saber. Alright, that one's not that bad. After I defeat you and gain total control over the timeline, I just want to reset everything. Yeah, very easy to avoid. Even though my past self could barely do that without dying. <laughs> all your progress, everyone's memories, I'll bring them all back to zero. I don't think the fuck you will. The hard blazing. All right, that one is hard to avoid. Okay. This is my favorite boss in Undertale, though. This has got to be my favorite one to fight. You have to do so much just to get to this boss fight. I know the same thing can be said for Sand. You know, Sans is really fun to fight, but this song, everything about this boss battle, the fact that this is the true ending of the game, in my opinion at least. And if you know what the best part of all this is, you'll do it! Oh, it's this one.
last dream. And then you'll lose me again. Azure already is chaos. Look at that! It's in Rainbow! I love Rainbow! You think about why you're here now. You can feel the empty space in your inventory getting smaller and smaller. And again! Whoa, 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 whoa! Yeah, the same sound that a gasser blaster makes. Huh. And again! Whoa, whoa, hold up, Buster. Dang it. It's really hard to avoid that one. Galacta Blazing. Alright, that one is definitely gonna kill me. Because you want a happy ending. Dev is this one. The one that I died to. I had 6 HP left and I died to that. And this attack does damage. <laughs> that, that was, I got so cocky. I was like, no hit, no hit, and I just die. Chaos Slicer. I don't know what that is. I think that's just the swords. Yep. Only got hit twice, not bad. Chaos Blaster. Oh. Because you never give up. Alright, this one this one is like really hard. Oh! 420! <laughs> Shocker Breaker 2. Oh, okay, that one is hard. Right, there, my 420 goes to 24. Here, determination. Why can't it go to like uh 1220, uh, December 20th, my birthday? I'll be turning 17 this year. Your determination, the power that lets you get this far. It's gonna be your downfall. Oh whoa, whoa. Oh, there we go. I love this hyper gun, there we go. Now, enough messing around! It's time to purge this timeline once and for all! Alright. If you don't get hit by any of these things, you actually can survive with 20 HP, like, or whatever it has to be. Yeah, just getting hit by one of those brings back to one. Even after that attack, you're still standing in my way? Wow, you really are something special. But don't get cocky. Up until now, I've been only using a fraction of my real power. Let's see what good your determination is against this. Expanding! Nope, just kidding. I like this song, though. But not better than the first phase. Alright, I cannot move to the other options. Uh, I can only struggle. You can't move your body. <laughs> Behold my true power! Dang it. Everybody dies at this part. Unless you're like, uh, Merg, who does this in like, no hits. Azrael blocks away. You can't move your body. I can feel it. Every time you die, your grip on this world slips away. Every time you die, your friends forget you a little more. Your life will end here in a world where no one remembers you. There we go. The whole world is ending. You can't move your body. Still, you're hanging on? That's fine. In a few moments, you'll forget everything, too. That attitude will serve you well in your next life. Ah, I tried so hard not to get hit. Astro blocks away. You can't move your body. <laughs> Still, come on! Show me what good your determination is now! Whoa, 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 whoa. You can't move your body. Nothing happened. You struggle. Nothing happened. You tried to reach your save file. Nothing happened. Seems saving the game really is impossible. But, maybe with what little power you have, you can save something else. I can move! And the save is, it's, it's, it's like, Rainbow! It's, 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 uh, I was about to say something that could be really offensive. 
people can't really take jokes, especially the leftist right. Huh. Like, the leftist right, that sounds like a centrist to me. The lost soul appears. Clash! You clash against the lost soul with all your might. I just gave her that little... Ooh! That little... Yeah! She feels your fighting spirit. It's familiar somehow. All humans will die. Oh god, not this shit again. <laughs> Seriously, dude. Undying the Undying really gave me some trouble. That gave me three hours of trouble. And now it's just burned into my memory how to actually deflect these shots. Before, when I first played this game, I did not deflect those shots really. You tap the light so light. You tap the lost so lightly. Something about the way you fight. It's all flooding back. Well, some humans are okay, I guess. You feel something faintly resonating within Azrael. Alphys. Within the depths of Azrael's soul, something... something's re resonating. The lost soul appears. Uh... Let's quiz. You asked the lost soul to help for help on the quiz question. She barely holds back from giving me an answer. You hate me, don't you? No, Alphys, actually I do hate you. I'm sorry, Alphys, I don't like you. The Lost Soul stands there. Oh, wait. I've gotta keep lying. Alright, the Lost Soul stands there. I want to fight her again, just to... Yeah, look at that, she fights like Metaton. The Lost Soul stands there. Encourage. You tell the Lost Soul that you'll continue to support her. Suddenly, she remembers. It's all flooding back. No, that's not true. My friends like me, and I like you too. You feel something resonating with an F. Within the depths of Azrael's soul, something's resonating. The lost souls appeared. Which one can you fight? Let's fight Sans. Dang it! The one time I could actually fight him without him actually dodging. Uh, I wish I could. I wish I could fight like Sans, but Sans is not even attacking. As far as I know, Sans is not attacking at it, at all. If we all know if Sans was attacking, he would attack much more violently. Huh. Let's crack a joke. You told the lost... Yeah, but don't remember. Yeah. Why everyone will? Why even try? Yeah, this, this reminds me of Fighting Sands. This is how it was Fighting Sands. Yeah, it was fun Fighting Sands. It really was. Uh, act. Lost Soul. Judgment! You'll never see him again. Why is Sans so emo? Yeah, this this is this reminds me of that one part of Sans where he does this. Yeah. The lost souls stand there. Why is this guy? There we go. The lost souls stand there. Take a break. You asked the Lost Soul to take a break from fighting with you. It nods its head solemnly. Seems like it will. No, I'm rooting for your kid. No, wait, you're my friend. I can never capture you. You feel something strongly resonating within Asriel. Must be Sans. Within the depths of Asriel's soul, something's resonating. The Lost Souls appeared. Preference. You tell the Lost Soul you prefer cinnamon instead of bar scotch. Somehow she faintly recalls hearing this before. This is for your own good, forgive me for this, but I must dab on you haters. Alright, this is Asgore attacking. Uh, Toriel doesn't attack like this at all. The lost souls stand there. Asgore, give him a big hug! You hug the lost soul. It seems like his aggression is slowly melting away. This is my duty. No one will leave again.
Alright. Uh, let's give her a hug. Hug me. Oh, yeah, now they're silent. Now you guys are just silent. Ah, oh, dang. Oh, it does one damage. Is that Toriel doing that with the fire then? Uh, how about we just give him some news? You tell Lossal that you won't hurt him, no matter what. Suddenly, the memories are flooding back. Your fate is up to you now. You are our future. You feel your friend's soul is resonating within you. As someone else, strangely, as your friends remembered you, something else began resonating within the soul, stronger and stronger. It seems that there is still one last person that needs to be saved. But who? Could it be Metaton? Could it be Muffet? Suddenly you realize it's Nasbluk. No. You reach out and call her name. Azriel? Huh? What are you doing? That was not us, that was Kara. You feel your friend's souls resting within Astral. What? What did you do? What's this feeling? What's happening to me? No, no, I don't need anyone. Whoa, whoa, hold up, Buster. Ah, stop, you're about to kill me. Stop it, get away from me. Do you hear me? I'll tear you apart. Oh yes, I'll tear you apart. Shoots out these things very slowly and there's not even that much. Do you know why I'm doing this? Why I keep fighting to keep you around? I'm not Kara, I'm Frisk. I'm the other guy. Kara is your brother, to me at least. I'm doing this because you're special, Kara. You're the best brother I had. Considering I don't have any brothers in real life. Because you're special. You're the only one that understands me. You're the one that has any fun to play with. No, that's not just it. I, I, I'm doing this because I care about you, Kara. I care about you more than anybody else. I'm not Kara, I'm Frisk. Frisk! I'm not ready to, for this end. I'm not ready for you to leave. I'm not ready to say goodbye to someone like you again. So please, stop doing this! Just let me win! Uh oh. Ah, oh, that's gotta hurt. Oh, oh, come on, dude. Oh, oh, now my other options. You're about to make me go away. Stop it, stop it. Oh. What the? I'm at a millionth of an HP. One billionth of an HP. One billionth HP. You're up. I'm so afraid, Kara. Kara, I... I... You're just floating head, I guess. I'm a floating head. Oh, this is like the area that you were in in a nature route when you fought a Mega Flowey. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Stop crying. I always was a crybaby, cry baby, wasn't I, Kara? I know. You're not actually Kara, are you? Kara's been gone for a long time. Uh, Kara's floating right above me, as you're saying this. <laughs> um, what? What is your name? Frisk? That's a nice name. Frisk. I haven't felt like this for a long time. As a flower, I was soulless. I lacked the power to love other people, unless you did a genocide route and Flowey actually showed a little bit of Azriel. However, with everyone's souls inside of me, I not only have my own compassion back, but I can feel other monsters as well. They all care about each other so much, and they care about you too, Frisk. I wish I could tell you how everyone feels about you. The Pyrus, Sans, Undyne, Alphys, Toriel... Monsters are weird. Even though they barely know you, 
It feels like they all really love you. <laughs> Frisk, I, I understand if you can't forgive me. I understand if you hate me. I acted so strange and horrible. I hurt you. I hurt so many people. Friends, family, bystanders. There's no excuse for what I've done. Forgive you. Um, wh wh what? Frisk, come on. You're, you're gonna make me cry again. Besides, even if you do forgive me, I can't keep those souls inside of me. The least I can do is return them. But first, there's something I have to do. Right now, I, I can feel everyone's hearts beating as one. They're all burning with the same desire, with everyone's powers, with everyone's determination. It's time for monsters to finally go free. Alright. Go, go, Power Rangers! Alright, please. Hey, look, it's the human souls! And they're gonna disappear forever and we'll never see them again. Yes! Yes! We tear that hole apart. That barrier was destroyed. The barrier was destroyed. Finally, for over a thousand years, that barrier finally gets destroyed. Frisk! I have to go now. Without the power of everyone's souls, I can't keep maintaining this form. In a little while, I'll turn back into a flower. I'll stop being myself. I'll stop being able to feel love again. So, Frisk, it's best if you just forget about me, okay? Just be with the people that love you. Comfort him. Hug him. <laughs> I don't want to let go. Frisk, you're you're going to do a great job, okay? No matter what you do, everyone will be there for you, okay? Well, my time's running out. Goodbye. Oh, you're stopping? By the way, Frisk, take care of mom and dad for me, okay? Frisk, this is all just a bad dream. Please wake up. Oh, you are awake, thank goodness. We, we, we were so worried, it felt like you were out forever. Yeah, any longer and I would have freaked out. Tell us next time you decide to take a nap, okay? Yeah, you made papyrus cry like a baby. What? I didn't cry. I don't cry. I just caught something in my eye. What'd you catch? Tears. Now, now. The important part is that Frisk is alright. Here, Frisk. Why not drink some tea? It'll make you feel better. Er, how about we give them space? Well, in this playthrough, I consider both Care and Frisk to be more so we're gonna say him. How about we give him space first? He must be very exhausted, though, for what I am not certain. Frisk, we do not remember exactly what happened. There was a flower and then everything went white, but now the barrier is gone. When you are ready, we will all return to the surface. It seems the door to the east will lead us there now. But before then, perhaps you might want to talk. You can say goodbye to all your wonderful friends. Do as you wish. We will all wait for you here. Oh, Frisk, I was afraid of my phone. I'm having a lot of fun with this texting feature. Sans, check out this one. Oh man, Tori. That's brutal. I can't believe the Queen has returned. And she's also that... She's also the huge Tori. You, you two are two feet from each other. Why are you texting? Worry not, Papyrus. We are texting for a good reason. And I'm gonna check my Instagram account. Ah, robot sons liked my post. Yeah, he follows my Instagram. 
I have a meme account and a personal account on uh, Instagram. Uh, the link to my meme account is going to be in the, in the description. I need to add my uh, personal account to that, too, as well. Worry not, Papyrus. We are texting for a good reason. Why is that? Well, because we're huge dorks. Sans, please do not say that. You are not a dork. You are more of a boomerad. Oh my god! <laughs> wow, those puns are even less funny coming from her. Then why are you smiling? It's a pity smile! Hey, Sans. Chris, Tori was telling me how she made a butterscotch pie for you. Oh, I should bake it for everyone sometime. Cooking? Can I help? Oh no, wait a second. Can I help too? Certainly, it'll be... One second thought. Maybe I'll order pizza. <laughs> oh, Papyrus. I like Sans more of Papyrus now, honestly. Papyrus is just fucking annoying. So, Asgore. How about making me a member of the... Well, Papyrus, now that the war is over, we might not need the Royal God anymore. What? Then what was the point of the human's quest? Been during all that way, and I'm still not a member of the Royal Guard. Truly, this is the worst possible ending. No, it's not. The worst ending is the soulless passive ending. This is the true passive ending. So, Alphys, what do you want to do now we're all free? We have the whole world to explore now. Well, of course, I'm out going to go out and, uh... You know, I to be honest, I'm gonna stay inside and watch anime like a total loser. As a person who really does not like anime, this just makes me cringe. I really don't like anime. That's the spirit! Everyone, a celebration! The being losers. <laughs> the Pirates has the right idea. Losing to Frisk is the best thing that, that has ever happened to me. So I'm glad that we, uh, what is it, Asgore? Oh, it? oh my god. Frisk, please, help me explain what anime is Asgore. You see, it's like a cartoon, but... With very shit. All right, all right, all right. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna be. I'm not gonna go on that path to talk about how much I really don't like anime. Uh, I always find that the animes with guns, some of them are actually cool. The ones with swords are kind of over redundant. Both of these are really over redundant. But my favorite anime, Robotech, the the new generation, has guns in it. So my second most favorite anime is gotta be Ro uh, Ronin Warriors that has swords in it. It's almost like a cartoon but with guns. Golly, that sounds neato. Where is this? Where can I see the anime? Hold on, I, I have some on my phone. Here, look at this. Oh, uh, what? That's the wrong guy. Golly, were those two robots kissing? Oh, wait, technology sure is something, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, I mean, it sure is. You gotta tell me. Do you think Asgore and Toyo are... Uh, ever gonna get back together? I hope they do. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's what I hope too. This thing about how cute they must have been together. It's quickly becoming my number one ship of all time. Tori and Gory. My my old boss and his ex-wife. Uh that sounds a lot less cool all of a sudden. Howdy Frisk! Sorry about almost trying to take your soul. I feel very bad about it. I hope we can still be the house. Hey, don't worry about Asgore. To I think everyone's tried to kill Frisk at least once. Except for Sans in this route. Oh, I see. In that case, I'm not sorry, Frisk. Asgore, that's not what I meant! I was about to save, but I'm not gonna save at this part. I'm actually gonna save before the... Actually, my last save will be before the, uh... Thing. That way I can do the final boss. If you leave here, your adventure will really be over. Your friends will follow you out the underground. Don't leave. I'm ready. Oh my! Isn't it beautiful? Everyone? Wow, it, it's even better than on TV. Way better. Better than I ever imagined. Chris, do you live with this? The sunlight is so nice and the air is so fresh. I really feel alive. Hey, Sans, what's that giant ball? We call that the sun, my friend. 
That's the sun? Wow, I can't believe I'm finally beating the sun. I could stand here and watch this for hours. Yes, it is beautiful, is it not? But we should really think about what comes next. Alright. Everyone, this is the beginning of a bright new future. An era of peace between humans and monsters. Frisk, I have something to ask of you. Will you act as our ambassador to the humans? I guess so. Yeah, Frisk will be the best ambassador, and I, Papyrus, will be the best mascot. No, the fuck you don't. Uh, oh my god, just get the fuck out here. I don't like you, Papyrus. Damn. Right. Well, someone's gotta keep it from getting in trouble. See you guys. Aw, oh, man, there goes my one of my favorite characters. Man, do I have to do everything? Papyrus, wait! Hey, Undyne, wait up! Whoops. Uh, should I do something? Toriel, stop, stop it, just... Well, gotta go. I'm about to leave you, Toriel, if you keep doing this shit. It seems that everyone is quite eager to set off. Frisk, you came from this world, right? So you must have a place to return to you, do you not? Well, what will you do now? I want to stay with you, I have places to go. In the realist in the realistic scenario, we would actually I would actually say this because I have a family to live with. But I don't want Toriel to just go running off like that, very heartbroken, like What? Frisk, you really are a funny child. If you had said that earlier, none of this would have happened. It's a good thing you took so long to change your mind. <laughs> well, I suppose if you really do not have any other place to go, I will do my best to take care of you for as long as you need, alright? Now, come along! Everyone is waiting for us! And that's it! That is Undertale! Alright. Froggit by Toby, Whimson by Toady, Pondering Life, Still a Bit Guilty, Mold Small by Toby, Luke's by Temmie, Found a New Cave, Slightly Bully Like, Vegetoid by Toby and Temmie, Big Ops by Toby, Cushy Grocer, Dedicated Yes Man, Naps Loop by Toby! Sleeping noise, I guess. Or it could be my cousin's name on YouTube, ZZZ. Papyrus by Toby and Temmie! That stupid duck. Sans by Toby! Special Inspiration. Jan Weedle. Snowdrake by Mongolia Porter. Ice Cap by Man Magnolia Porter. Still looking for laughs. Thinking about his hat. Crypt Rock by Magnolia Porter and Toby? Doggo by Toby. Finding Peace and Quiet has his own scene I dog. What? Dog, Dagami, and Dagaressa by Toby? Finally, number one knows Nuzzle Champions. Lesser Dog by to Temmie and Toby. Greater Dog by Toby and Temmie. Searching for affection, unaware of life's changes. Oh, what the heck are you doing on 9? On 9 is I'm going to be armored by Temmie. That should help things. Alpha's design. Oh god, I'm dying. Aaron! By Temmy, reluctantly. Moldy Bug by Toby. Whoa! Still flexing, wistful, adjusting. Washua, inspired by Omopat. Temmy, 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 normal janitor. Mad Dummy by Toby. Shiren by Toby. Calm down just a bit. Taking piano lessons again. Oh god. I don't like this ending for Metaton. Metaton by Toby. I don't like this ending. I wish Metaton just kept the EX form. The entire EX form. Because it looks better. You can't lie. Special inspiration. Bob Sparker, Sarah, and Jan Weidel. Weedle. 
Volkson by Magnolia Porter. Sunderplane by Toby. Scrolling, scrolling happily. A new student at school. Pyro by Toby. Muffet by Michelle. Spider success with a new bakery. Continually in trouble. Royal Guards by Toby. Use your imagination. Final Froggit by Toby. Whims a lot by Toby. Giving life its own meaning. The long battle finally ends. Astigmatism by Toby. Domineering Glass is stellar. Magic by Toby. Night Night by Toby. Street Magician taking a well-deserved nap. Amalgamates? Unknown. Living with their families. Yeah. Look at that. Asgore by Toby. Monster Kid by Magnolia Porter. Sounds like some Earthbound music here. Toriel by Toby. Monster Kid going to school. Toriel being a teacher. There's Mount Ebbett. Or Ebot. The end! Yes! Oh, oh, oh god, no! Stop it! No! How could you do this to me, Asriel? I thought this was the end of the game. <laughs> Did you really think it was over? Oh, with the sweat on his head, you see that sweat on his head? I mean, we haven't even done a special thanks yet. Ready? Let's end all of this for good. Tom Dickinson, yeah. Ah, dang it. Alright, who do you expect to actually even do this? Oh wow, really? I can see where they're going with this, alright? Ever since I did a genocide route, I've been really good at dodging attacks. Alright, this one's not bad. Dang it! Alright, never mind, this one's actually really bad. Dang it! And there's actually a secret for doing this without touching any of the credits. And it must have been hell to test out that secret. Thanks to friends and family for supporting us and Undertale team, thanks! You the player from the bottom of our hearts. Without you, all this would be impossible. Good night. Alright. Well, let's go to the middle of the screen and announce my new Let's Play. My next play will be... I don't know. It might be my most favorite game of all time. I might do that game. There we go, Undertale. The end. That is the true passive ending of Undertale. 
Well, I will see you guys in my next video. My next video will be a uh, return of an old Let's Play I did back in uh, September. Alright, but it's been very good to do this Let's Play with you guys. It was really fun. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye!